Welcome to our lesson for today. We are focusing on systems technology and we are looking at hardware. We did explore a few uh, basic output devices. Now we're going to look at advanced output devices. Now these devices does not necessarily mean that they have to be used in a computer. Now these devices would be your output uh, devices but in a form of audio output. Now these devices they project sound and audio. Alright so now as they project sound that sound or that audio comes in a form of an output. Now for example if you think of your headsets or speakers you are playing your music you get it from your speaker you are communicating with someone online you get it from your headset so basically this is a different way of projecting output rather than just getting a soft copy or getting a hard copy right and then other output devices that we can explore would be your fax now how does a fax become an output device now when someone is sending you um, an email and they're not sending you an email to your email address but to your fax machine or if someone is faxing you a specific document so when you receive that document it comes out in a form of an output and therefore making your fax be an output device then you also have some other multifunctional devices where you would get a printer that does a lot of other things it prints it also faxes it scans so those are the devices that we can classify under a multifunctional device then we also have a data projector now obviously your data projector will project data from a computer or from a laptop which will obviously be viewed in a form of an output and lastly you'd have your CD or DVD player and blu-ray that would obviously play your CDs and project your image. So these are some of the uh, output devices that are more advanced other than your printer or your screen. Right, thank you for joining us today. See you next time.